bruv, you are having a bubble. If you guys need coins and need them instantly, check out FIFA coins stuck down in the description. There's a discount code on the screen you can use on I'm right. Yo, what's going on people and welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you some potential silver players that could be turning into gold players on Ultimate Team next Friday when the upgrades come out on FIFA 15 Ultimate Team. Now some of these are probably going to happen and some of them are just potential upgrades. I'll show you the ones that have already been upgraded in head-to-head -head game modes and when I say that I don't mean the Game Day Plus updates. Make sure you turn those off and then check the ratings from there when you download the latest updates or go on to www.sofifa.com in the description down below and you can check out the players real ratings there. So I'm not just making these ratings up guys, they're actually from EA themselves. There's, a, there's two players in here actually who are just potential upgrades and I'll go through them. You can see them on the screen right now. But yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video, as always a like would be awesome. If you don't, drop a dislike, let me know why in the comment section. But Emre Chan is the first player who I think should be potentially upgraded. Now he hasn't had an upgrade in head to head, but he's been outstanding for Liverpool at centre back. Well since he switched to a centre back, he's just been great in my opinion. Has great ball control as well. And when he eventually moves back into midfield, he's going to be quality for Liverpool, I can assure you that. Bayern Munich might have made a mistake by letting him go, I don't know. You let me know in the comments section down below, but if he actually gets this upgrade, it will be outrageous. 80 pace, 79 dribbling, and 80 physical, and don't forget guys, this geezer has four star skills. So he'll have four star skills as a centre back, and we have not seen that since the days of FIFA 11 when PK had it, I do believe. But remember guys, this is a potential upgrade that I'm guessing. This actually hasn't happened in head to head yet. But I think he deserves an upgrade. You guys let me know in the comment section down below. Do you think Emery Chan deserves an upgrade or not? Drop a comment. Yeah. Moving on to Charlie Austin we have next. This one has actually happened in head-to-head. -head. You can go and check it on SoFIFA.com. The link will be in the description down below. And yeah, definitely deserves it. He's been decent for QPR. Obviously, they ain't doing the best. They've just lost Harry Redknapp as the manager. He's resigned. But yeah, he's been upgrading head-to-head. -head. He's also got an inform as well, which will make his upgraded card even better with 81 shooting on a low-rated gold that is 75 rated. So you can look forward to Charlie Austin, you QPR fans. Moving on to the next player is Gabriel. Obviously, just signed for Arsenal. Hasn't actually played played yet but he's been upgraded in head to head to 77 and he's another one players going from silver to gold which is going to be pretty awesome he has decent pace okay defending but his physical stat doesn't look the best in my opinion so I don't know how he's going to be in game I haven't actually used this silver card but he's going to get an upgrade that's why he hasn't been transferred to Arsenal yet his upgrade will be coming out on Friday guys this Friday I do believe according to Chuboy who is EA's community manager so yeah moving on to the next player Sheryshev for Villarreal actually I think he's a Real Madrid player loaned to Villarreal and uh, yeah, he's been great this season, got so many assists, scored about 5 or 6 goals I do believe, even scored against Barcelona last week. And yeah, he's going to be a goal player with some okay stats, 80 pace, 76 dribbling and also 79 passing on him because he does get a lot of assists as I said before. So yeah, he's definitely worthy of an upgrade as well as Nathaniel Klein you can see here going from a silver to a gold as well. And that card is going to be incredible as you can see, 87 pace with some decent defending and decent physical stats as well. Nathaniel Klein fully deserves an upgrade, even rumoured to be leaving Southampton maybe for Manchester United in the future like his former teammate Luke Shaw did. So we're moving on to Sacco from West Ham and this is a definite upgrade like there's no doubt about it he should be upgraded simply for the fact that he came from League 2 and he's banging in the goals in the Premier League for West Ham been a great signing for them and this one actually hasn't happened in head-to-head -head. I'm just predicting this upgrade because I don't know why he haven't done it he's only 72 rated in head-to-head -head. I'm not sure why he should be a goal player like his teammate Enna Valencia who is 75 rated so yeah Saka would be an awesome card to use as you can see 77 shooting 85 pace he has three star skills as well so he's gonna be a great player to use for them cheap gold teams moving on to the last player in this video we have Bernat from Bayern Munich who is a silver player currently he's gone in form which is gonna make his upgraded card just that little bit more better and he's actually already been upgraded to 76 in normal game modes again if you want to go and check that so fifa.com will be in the description and actually he had four star skills last year but EA took it away just imagine if he had that as a left back in the Bundesliga for Bayern that would have been absolutely amazing but it's a fully deserved upgrade should be a goal player no doubt about it and those are the players for this video guys I hope you enjoyed it if you did remember to drop a like if you didn't drop a dislike let me know why in the comment section and also let me know some more silver players that should go from silvers to golds if you missed the first episode it'll be in the description and I'll see you guys soon. Take care. You don't want to win the business, so keep back. You don't want to win the business, so keep back. You don't want to win the business, so keep back. You hear me, Blair? You hear me, Blair? You don't want to win the business, so keep back. You don't want to win the business, so keep back. You don't want to win the business, so keep back.